All right, let's have a look at this question. They say tangent x equals to k, and then the question also tell me the x is an acute angle, and then they ask me to find the sine two x. Okay, first you must get the idea like the x and two x is a different size of angle, so you cannot simply say oh I just multiply two here. You cannot do that. So first thing is you need to draw out the triangle at the first quadrant. How do I know it's first quadrant? Because acute angle is the angle between. 0 and 90 degree. So I need to draw a triangle at the first quadrant. And then I label this one as an x. Alright, since the question tell me tangent x equals to k, so what I want to do here is I will add a 1 for it. It's k over 1. From the so Tua, I know tangent is basically opposite over adjacent. So it will be k over 1. And then right now, I want to use the Pythagoras to find the length of the hypotenuse. Pythagoras tell me a squared plus b squared equals to c squared. So I know that the hypotenuse will be square root of 1 squared plus k squared. I'm going to call it 1 plus k squared. Alright, why I want to do that? Because I need to find sine and cos at the same time. Because the question asked me to do sine 2x. I know the formula for sine 2x is basically 2 sine x cos x, isn't it? So, so this is the reason why I need to find the sine x and cos x and then I sub into this formula. Alright, so if I want to find my sine x, right? So my sine x is basically is opposite over hypotenuse, which is k over square root 1 plus k square. And then same idea for my cos x. My cos x is basically adjacent over hypotenuse, which is 1 over square root 1 plus k square. Right, right now I have the sine and cos ready. I just need to substitute this one into the sine 2x formula. Then I can easily find the answer I want. So this is what I have. So I have 2. Sine will be k over square root 1 plus k square. Multiply the cos will be 1 over square root 1 plus k square. Alright, over here you just need to expand them. Then you should be able to get the perfect answer. Square root times square root will give you a uh, square of the square root, which is get rid of the square root. So the final answer should be 2k over 1 plus k squared. Alright, this is how we solve this kind of trigonal question.